Hello, fellow investor. Welcome to Money Mind Show. Uh, this is a show where we talk about finance, investing, and anything related to finance and your money. So I came across this article where it says um, these couple stocks will go to zero, you know, of one dollar valuation. And uh, I, th I, I, you know, I took interest in this article and I say, uh, let me go deep into this and see if we um, we do agree with analysts these analysts who are predicting these stocks will go either to zero or they might just stay to a dollar and we're going to see what kind of stocks are these and um and, and they're going to see what's your opinion right oh what kind of stocks reasoning behind it and what's your opinion on the, these stocks do you think they will go to zero so um um this is an article where actually it was on cnn business um and then it says um a loop capital uh that's analysts uh his name is anthony uh chukumba he's he he has given a one dollar target price for uh bed and bath and beyond which is this stock you know you know ticker symbol is bby and uh, he says the stock uh, has a dramatic rise and um, equally stunning fall last week after GameStop uh, chairman, right? Ryan Cohen uh, decided to sell his stakes. You know, when Cohen sold his stock, of course, um, we've seen the Bed and Bath Beyond just, just hammered. You know, it came all the way from, I think was five, if you look at the $5 moving average, um, or five dollar trading days it actually was at 25 it was at 27 and right now you can see that day he just came from 18 boom to 10 and now is at eight dollars so the stock has fallen and this analyst um uh whose name is loop capital is predicting the stock may go all the way down to one dollar or might just go to zero or something like that right um and the reason he says because of demand uh, from, you know, in order's payment from a company that they can be demanded to pay, which could put bed and, bed and bath beyond uh, into a death spiral. That's one of the reasons. Uh, but also, it's not only that stock. We say we have few stocks and uh, there is uh, Eric Handler, MK Empana has one dollar target on movie theater chain MC. Citing concern about the uh, company valuation, doubts about the broader comeback of Hollywood at box office. Uh, he believed that most people right now at this moment will be going to, will stay home and just watch a movie at home. You know, Netflix, for example, they have specials or Amazon Prime. Who's staying instead of going to movie theater? And then therefore this company will not have earnings or will just go to either zero or stay to a uh, dollar and uh, David Trainer, CEO of new uh, new construct an investment research firm has a zero price target on GameStop DoorDash an electric vehicle maker Rivian so he says or he believes that these three stocks which is GameStop um, uh, DoorDash and Rivian that will be going to pretty much zero uh, the the concern that he has is about amount of cash the three farms are burning through to try to stay competitive. He referred to the stock as zombies, implying that the companies could potentially need to file for bankrupt. So that's the reason he says the company are paying too much money to stay relevant, but uh, in the meantime, they don't have enough earning. And that's the reason he believes that these companies will be going to bankrupt. Whether you believe it or not, you know, that's his reason. Um, and that will be, of course, chapter, um, a typical chapter 11 filing wiped out a value of, uh, for stock owners and bond, uh, bond holders and other creditor are first in line to get paid. You know, um, you can, you can deep dive more into chapter, chapter 11. Um, another stock, which will be our kind of last stock analyst is predicting might be going to zero or one dollar will be a uh, carnivore right or oh, ticker symbol ccl so morgan stanley uh, jamie rollo put out report on cruise line uh, ccl in late june that outlined worst case scenario 
of zero dollar stock if the global economy weakens significantly. Um, Deutsche, Deutsche Bank Health slapped one other price target for struggling uh, drugstore chain Rite Aid or RAD earlier this year. Hill has since boosted, boosted his target to $4, but is still nearly 50% below the current price. Hill has also maintained his sell ratio on the stock. So the other stock, of course, is RAD. A, A, R A D. The stock, of course, is a, a rate a rate eight. So those are the four stocks. Uh, those are the actually six stocks. Um, but the most most one we are actually um focusing more uh, AMC um uh B B B B B Y, which is Bed Bath and Beyond, GameStop. Uh, because these are the most talked about most people actually trade and know them well and uh, meme stocks or AMC. So, you know, if we, uh, just let's go back here and we see AMC. Uh, AMC actually was last week. He was at 24. This is five five day trading days, which was like a 24. Now is a nine. Let's see uh, what's a GameStop. Uh, if we look at the GameStop we can see uh if we look at the five day trading day it was actually came all the way from 42 right now to 33. so that's a report from these analysts believing that stocks may fall from all the way from whatever the price there right now all the way to zero or they might stay to one dollar you know in case of the uh, drugstore you know um chain right it was pretty to go all the way to you know one dollar or something like that but now they kind of up up a little bit their prediction and says uh, it might be going to four dollars or might stay to four dollars so what's your um take on these analysts do you believe these analysts do you think these stocks will be going to zero do you trade them leave comment below and this is again is uh, mr money mind we talk about money investing and anything related to finance so if it's your first time on this channel please subscribe share we need to grow this channel thank you very much for watching till we meet again